Hi there, it's Dr. Judith Browse, your book shepherd. I've got an idea that maybe you hadn't thought about. Have you thought about tapping into books, works, ideas that have become old? Maybe some people think stale, and yet maybe they aren't. In the year 2022, something really phenomenal happened in the children's world. The classic book, Winnie the Pooh, dropped into the public domain. I can tell you by the end of this year, 2022, you will see a gazillion variations of Winnie the Pooh. Did they have to pay to use it? Mm -mm. It's in the public domain. So now a lot of people do think that anything that lands there, people have abandoned it since it's old, it's not any good. Nope, it's just you know, maybe they feel there's 70 years, which is the copyright, has run its course, and they're going to let it go. So what you want to do is make sure that wherever you're looking for things, and it says public domain, it actually is a public domain. Um, if you see something that emits the material is often marked Creative Commons on it, you can uh, do variations. You can find something, gee, this sounds really kind of good. I mean, there is an old saying, what, what goes around comes around. And what's old becomes new once ago again because things have a circle, a cycle to them. What you need to do is add maybe a new twist, a new variation, you know, your unique view of whatever this core thing is and take it and run with it. You'd be surprised what you just might come up with. This is Judith Browles. Hey, follow me on my Twitter account at my book shepherd and subscribe to my newsletter every friday morning a really shorty comes out about publishing related things in general and you can find it on my website homepage or just go to paper.li forward slash judith browse and make sure you listen to my podcast author you your guide to book publishing with over 500 episodes 9 million downloads there's something in there for you we'll see you next time